Hi. So thank you so much for watching this video. And I'm going to teach you one of the multiplication concepts. See, if you look at the Vedic maths, in Vedic maths, we have 130 plus videos, 130 plus concepts. Okay. Out of 130 plus concepts, according to me, 36 concepts is only on multiplication. Out of these 36, there are two universal methods are there. One method is dot method and second method is base method. These two methods, by using these two methods, you can solve any kind of multiplication in one or two steps. So in this video, I'm going to explain a base method. So first thing, first thing, what is base? You might watch my previous video or my other video. You might know about it, but people are watching. This is the first video. What is base? Base is nothing but any number is in the form of 10 to the power of n. It's called base number. So that is 10, 100, 1000 and so on. Any number which is in the form of 10 to the power of n is called base number. While doing multiplications, you consider any one number depends on the problem. By end of this video, you will understand how to consider. You just need to consider one base number and you can solve the calculations. And not only considering the base number and you need to apply the respective method. So how many methods are there in base method? In base, we have mainly three, three methods, three types. Out of these three models, one number is above the base, numbers are above the base, and numbers are below the base, and one number is above the base, and one number is below the base. In these, in these three, I'm going to teach you uh, two concepts. In this video, I'm going to teach you one concept. In next video, I'm going to teach you one more concept. So now, now the concept is base 100 and above the base. Above the base, nothing but the number should be above the base. Two numbers should be above the base. If we take uh, 1, 0, 4, multiply with 1, 0, 6. 1, 0, 8, multiply with 1, 0, 3. Like you take 1, 1, 9, 1, 0, 5. So the numbers looks like same, right? Simple, right? But do one thing. Pause the video and write these problems on your paper. Just observe how many steps you are taking while solving it. Let's say, let's, let's me take it 108 into 103. If I do it 108 into 103, if you give this problem to any student, how the students do it? 3 into 8, 3 into 0, 3 into 1. Next, uh, remaining steps are zeros, that's fine. And next, 1 into 8, 1 into 0, 1 into 1. 3 eight zero, 24. I done the 4, 3 zeros are 0, plus 2, and 3 ones are 3, 3, right? Next, 0, 0, and 0. Next, 8, 0, 1. And you need to add the numbers. You need to add the numbers. 4, 2, 1, 1, 11, so 1, 1 plus 1, right? 1 and 1. If you look at the answer is triple one two four. You you got you got you got all these steps. Let me explain the concept in very simple manner by using the Vedic maths above the base number. Look at this. Very simple steps. Just follow the steps. The given number is one zero four. The base is hundred. Hundred is one zero four is above the hundred. The difference is plus four. Hundred plus four. Hundred plus six. Right, 100 plus 4, 100 plus 6. If you can consider, this is right hand side and this is left hand side. So take right hand side. Right hand side is 4, 6, 0, 24. Left hand side is cross addition 1, 1, 0. Right, same answer. I think we did some mistake here. 0, 104 plus 6, 104 plus 4, 1, 1, 1, 10 plus 4. Simple. 
four six zero twenty four one zero four plus six one one ten. Look at this. Plus eight plus three. Simple. Hundred plus eight. Hundred plus three. So simple. Take right hand side and left hand side. Right hand side. Eight three zero twenty four. Cross addition one one one. How many steps we did it here, and how many steps we what we did here? You don't need to write steps. You don't need to write RHS, LHS, and you can directly write the answer. Let me explain one more problem. Plus nineteen and plus five. Nineteen five zero ninety five one two four is the answer. Hope you got it. Simple one step direct direct calculations. Let me give you more three examples to make you perfect in the concepts. One one two multiply with one zero four. One one five multiply with one zero six. One zero seven multiply with one zero nine. Once you understood the concept, doing the questions is so simple. Base. By observing the number which is nearby ten or hundred or thousand, so obviously this is nearby hundred. So base hundred, compare the numbers. Hundred plus twelve, hundred plus four. Simple. So RHS and left LHS, right hand side and left hand side. Right hand side twelve four zero forty eight. And one one six is the answer. And this one, once you understood, you need to do it everything in the mind. One one five plus fifteen and plus six. Fifteen in the mind, six in the mind. Fifteen six zero, right? Fifteen in the mind, six in the mind. Fifteen six zero, ninety. Left hand side one two one. Hope you got it. Plus seven. Plus nine seven nine zero sixty three cross addition right so one one six simple you you just need to understand the concept and need to do the calculation in the mind plus seven plus nine seven nine zero sixty three and one one six cross addition this is above the base method. In the next video, you are going to learn below the base method. So, thank you so much for watching. Thanks a lot. See you in the next video.